Hello everybody, this is Cyrus here, back with another Matchbox 5-pack review. This time it's on the British Roadways 5-pack. This is new for 2024. It's not uh, new for this part of the year, though. Uh, it's a few months back, but backstory, I was not able to find uh, too much of this 5-pack, and I was coming across it very sparingly at certain stores. And then earlier today I was at a Toys R Us and I managed to find two of these packs. I picked up both of them partly because one of the cars in the set, the Morris Meyer, this does have two interior variations. Uh, so if you want to get both interior variations, um, you'll need to check the five pack. Uh, how I recommend checking uh, with the interior variation on this Morris Minor is by shining a flashlight into the package and then you can get a better look at the car itself and see which side the steering wheel is on. So we'll get one of these two five packs cracked open. Also, this is my first time getting the Morris Minor and we've actually gotten about four releases of that car uh, pretty quickly. So around the uh, beginning, or not beginning, around the mid part of 2023, we got it in the new silver or not new, but in a silver version for their 70th anniversary. Then we got it in a kind of a dark red version or metallic red version as a nine pack exclusive. Then it came out in this one, um, five pack here uh, for 2024. And then they also did a green version for the basics for 2024 as well. So we've gotten uh, three new decos of this thing uh, it, oh, in the last couple months. So before we take a look at the Morse Minor, we'll take a look at the other cars starting from the bottom. Here we have the Land Rover Defender 90 in kind of that National Park kind of green paint. The only difference being it's a little bit sparkly and you don't have the National Park logos. Uh, I'm personally a sucker for some of the older Land Rovers that had more of the boxy uh, hood design. But I gotta tell you, this one's actually pretty um, cool in my opinion. Definitely for a modern Land Rover, I do quite like this one. I do have also a light blue version, kind of a light blue or baby blue version. That one I got out of the um, Matchbox Fairy Port playset. I did a video on that. If you want to check that out, I'll leave a link to that in the description. Next up, we've got the Levesque Taxi. Now, this blue version is a new deco. Uh, originally, they were doing it in all black uh, throughout all of its releases. I believe this was 2019, I believe. Yeah, 2019. Uh, so this one, um, blue paint job, is something majorly different than what we've seen in the past. I do like this casting. Uh, it would have been cool if they actually included the uh, London taxi in this um, set, but that's just my opinion. And then next up, we've got the... 15 Jaguar F-Type Coupe. Uh, certainly when it comes to um, Land Rover, uh, they're not really the best brand of cars. I mean, the toy merchandise is um, cool, but Jaguar, on the other hand, not only are the real-life things cool, but they're also long-lasting. So definitely uh, any merchandise that Matchbox does is certainly a welcome addition to the line whenever they do merchandise of Jaguars, and they did come out with a new one for 2024 in kind of a dark blue um, color that's similar to what we got in the Morris Minor in this five pack. Kind of, this one's kind of a charcoal gray or charcoal silver color, whatever you want to call it. You do have some nice front uh, prints for the headlights. Uh, no print for the grille though, and then you do have prints for the taillights at the back. Also, the Land Rover, there are prints for both the headlights and grill. Same thing goes with the Levesque Taxi. Next up, we've got the Mini Cooper Cabrio uh, convertible. N and yes, it's called, um, it has the word Cabrio in it, but it is a convertible style Mini Cooper. You'll notice also with this one that the seats are kind of pushed up as opposed to that one. They're not pressed down. That's because this is actually a rivet holding the interior piece in. And then it partly clips into this spot right here at the back. It's kind of hard to see if I can get the camera to focus. There we go. 
Uh, there's your front print. They went with a nice metallic orange color, which I think looks quite good in my opinion. Uh, yeah, it's kind of a metallic orange looking at it off camera. It might look more sparkly, but on camera than metallic, but I can guarantee that in person off camera, it does look, it is metallic. And then finally the car you've all, um, that I'm really pumped about. This is the, um, well, none of these cars I have, but this one I'm really happy about. This one's probably my favorite just because I love older style cars. So this one is the left-hand drive. So this one would be found in other parts of Europe. Uh, again, sometimes people get um, a little bit um, carried away because since, no offense to those of you out there, but some people can um, focus on the fact that with European cars, you drive on the right side. That might be the case in the UK, but remember in the rest of Europe, it's kind of different. You know, they're just, they drive the same way we do. And if I get the other five pack opened, uh, I don't know much about the uh, Morris car company, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, here's the other version. So if I turn this around, hopefully you can see. And I did check this in the store. So both of these have the steering wheel on the either side. Maybe if I, it might be kind of hard to see, but I can guarantee you um, or I can guarantee that that steering wheel is on the opposite side. You can kind of see it there. It's hard to see, but if I had a flashlight, I'd be able to show it. I'll see if I can do another video showing that. And then here's the version. And this one's much easier to tell that this is the version that's on the left side of the car. And we'll quickly pull out just all the other models while we're at it, make a little display here. Put our little uh, burst miners there. Land Rover can go in the back. Put our other Land Rover right there. We'll put our little back taxi in front of the Land Rover. And then our second Jaguar can go back here. So that just about does um, this video. You can let me know in the comments what you think down you think down below of this five pack. Uh, until then, thanks for watching. I'll see you in some more videos very soon. Have a good, safe rest of your day, guys. Bye.